Hello YouTubers, Neil and Neil's Coins. Uh, quick little video. I bought uh, a while back. I bought a book. I showed it on one of my videos. You'd have to search and find it. But it's uh, it's just a book on uh, Eisenhower and Anthony dollars. And in the back of the book, what I well, if the coins don't fall out, let me have a little technical difficulties here. Hang on one second. Alright, uh, let's see here. Alright, let's see if I can do this without them falling out. Now, in the back of the book, it has Susan B. Anthony's uh, dollars. Real nice collection of them. So, what I was going to do is take it out of this book and put it in a Dansko album like this. Well, that ain't going to work, is it? Anyway, it's a Dance Girl album, book album. It has uh, different years and different, all that. But it said, I bought it at this last coin show. It says it has all of them. Well, I got to looking in this book. Well, it don't have the Proust coins. It only has these two years. And then... Uh, some of the others. Let me slide you back a little bit. Uh, so many of the others. So, I didn't realize that because uh, it was wrapped in a cellophane wrapper and you couldn't open it up to see. So, I'm thinking you can buy the different pages. I'm pretty sure you can. But I'm sure they make a book that has all the pages in it. Uh, I'm not sure why uh, it don't. And during the show... I found another one, another book. It just says Susan B. Anthony dollars on it. And it don't have any years. So I picked it up and looked at it. And then I glanced at it real quick. Uh, and it had coins in it. It has all the coins in it. It has some proofs. It don't have the top two proof. That's, that's expensive coin. That's probably in uncirculated it's probably close to a hundred dollar coin that's why it's not in this book but it's the same way it don't have it's well it ain't the same way let me take that back it don't have the 99 year model so i'm like well that ain't gonna work but i went ahead and bought it anyway because if i get that one coin it's a complete book, and I can sell it, which I probably have that coin somewhere. And then a uh, couple rows over, I found this set. It's in a Whitman, some kind of holder here. It don't say, I don't think, what holder this is. It's probably some generic holder. But it had all the coins in it. It don't have the 99 years, which I have in that first book that I showed you wherever I did with it uh, but I bought this at face value I gave 12 bucks for this so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these out and put in that first book the one it says through 99 uh, find the 99s and I'll have a complete book there find that one 79 type 2 coin and I'll have a foot full book there and then i still have a few odd ones left that i can sell at the our coin meeting but i thought this was a pretty good set 12 bucks you can't go wrong you can always get your money back out of this i could probably run it through the auction and make five or six bucks on it or more if it gets somebody get two people that really want it um 79 all the 79 all the 80 dollars and all the 81 dollars i was hoping that was the top two that i needed in that first book but it ain't it's the top one uh, there's a top one and a top two on the 81 and 79 and it's a clip what it is is the mint mark it has a like a clear uh s for san francisco mint mark but it it's very obvious what it is. And on the top ones, they're kind of, um, it's just a bad strike, really. It's kind of muted. And you can see it's an S, but it's like it's got 
uh, squished or a little extra material on it. Same way with the Type 1 and Type 2 on the 81s. But uh, other than that, really nice coins on there. I just wanted to show you that little information about Susan B's. They're not expensive coin unless you're getting the Proof 99. I don't know. I may have it here. I'm hang on one sec. Yeah, I have it. I may have showed this coin to you before, but it comes in this little uh, box. Kind of like cheaply made, to be honest with you. Got a little certificate with it. But this is a... This is actually a very nice coin. The uh, 1999 Susan B. coin. It comes in this little holder, like I mentioned. And it also comes in this little thing here. There's a lot of smudge on the thing. But I'll take it out of this and put it in, the, in a book that has the 99 uh, proofs. And I'm going to have to do some research. Uh, probably go to Dansko's uh, uh, website and see what book I actually need. Because I have two. Like this one has a number on the, on the end. Oops. It'll focus. 7180. And this book must be an older one. Well, they both say 7180. Hang on a minute. Let me verify that. Yes, they both say 7180. One must just be an older book. Well, I'm pretty sure it is. And then one's newer. But I'll complete them. What I'll usually do is I'll complete it. And then I'll run it through the auction. Um, other than that, I guess, yeah, that's about it. So y'all, uh, please like, hit that thumbs up button share whatever you want to do and i'll see you next week or excuse me yeah i guess it will be next week it'll be tuesday night